fair coming out. We're just clearing out the lines on the transporter erector there in preparation for launch. Next major milestone will come up at the T-minus 60 second mark. That'll be where Falcon 9 transitions into startup, meaning its flight computers will have taken over the launch countdown. And then at T-minus two seconds, we'll ignite those Merlin 1D engines in preparation for liftoff. Payloads continuing to look healthy for today's launch attempt. Falcon 9 is in startup. And with that, Falcon 9 has transitioned into startup. Weather is looking good. Range is ready to support. Next major milestone will be... Launch abort has started. And it sounds as though it looks like we have the clock has held. I believe I heard a launch abort was called. Now, launch abort is not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, at the point that we are underneath T minus 60 seconds, uh, Falcon or the ground team can call an abort uh, if they see something that doesn't look quite right. So we're going to listen in to the loops a little bit here, see if we can find out more. Bear with us a moment. And on countdown one, this is a launch structure um, we've awarded, currently uh, evaluating uh, vehicle remains. Hey, welcome back, folks. Now, if you've been following along, you know that we had an abort called uh, just under the T minus 60 second mark. The launch director called out an, uh, an abort, um, but the ground teams are still investigating what happened there. Now, keep in mind the purpose of a countdown is to help us catch potential issues prior to flight. 
there are many, many ways that a launch can go wrong and only one way that it can go right. And given that, we are very cautious on the ground. And if the team or the vehicle sees anything that looks slightly off, we stop the countdown and try again another day. Now, again, the vehicle and the payload remain in good health, but unfortunately, this will end our launch attempt for today. We do have a backup opportunity tomorrow, just a little bit earlier at 6.15 a.m. Pacific. We hope you'll